when we say classical physics as opposed to non-classical physics, another way to say that is physics that we perceive by our senses. We hear it, see it, feel it, taste it, touch it. The other physics, the non-classical physics, we can't do any of those things to it. So our standard, our, our general physics, which is mechanical classical physics is, well, if I can see it, it's real, you know, show it to me, I'll believe it. And that's what a lot of people say, show it to me, you know, give me proof. When on the other hand, there's a whole other universe out there that, that could care less what we can see or hear or feel or taste. Because, well, for instance, sight is only one octave and countless octaves of the energy in the universe. So you don't see radio waves. You don't, actually, you don't see light. You don't see heat. I mean, you don't see half the stuff you deal with every single day. And you, yet you take them for granted. And so we have developed surrogate senses, like meters. Okay, I can't measure the frequency. You know, I can't see this particular frequency, but I can make a meter that can show me that there's something going on here. So we developed all kinds of surrogate uh, extensions of our senses, and that's all they are. What we really need to do is take the leap beyond that to the universe part that we can't see and we can't measure, and we don't know it's there. It's called scalar by the technical people. It's all there, we know it's there, but there's more going on than what our eyes telling us. You take two magnets and you put them together, we can see that, we can feel them pulling or pushing apart, so that's your sensorial existence, the reality is that magnet doing this. And I'm sitting back saying, yeah, wait a minute, there's something else going on here, this does not compute. Well, this book is what's behind the walls in polar forces, whether it's a magnet or electricity, or male and female, or light and dark, or any polar dichotomy you can come up with, these are the forces that dictate what's going on behind the physical manifestation.